guys, what's up? How's it going? Uh, today we're gonna go over how to draw Jack Skellington. This is Halloween drawings, by the way. We're gonna go over how to draw Jack Skellington. He's it's a really cool design, uh, and we're gonna go over his head only. Uh, I'm gonna be using this Charpak marker as a point at the end of it. That's really the only thing you really need. You can use a sharpie with a point at the end of it, and that's pretty much it. So let's kind of get into this. Uh, I'm gonna start with a circle. Some versions of him have kind of a pointed top of the head, but I'm going to choose just to do a, uh, just kind of a normal circle for him. You know, nothing too fancy. And uh, I'm going to be, I'm going to mark the inner parts of the eyes. I do that with a marker sometimes, just to kind of get my placement down before I start. And I'm going to draw kind of this angry kind of eye, kind of like furrowed eye on each side. And it's weird because he wasn't really an angry guy, right? He was just kind of scary and, you know, kind of witty and stuff like that. And uh, I'm going to pull this kind of, and it looks like, his eye looks kind of like a bean. I'm pulling that there for the kind of like underneath the eyeball, of the, the eye. What is that? The, uh, like a bag under the eye. Same thing on this side, again, that kind of bean look. And then his nose is basically really tiny, uh, almost like apostrophes or commas. You know what I mean? It's kind of big on one side. And you could even do it the other way around. I've seen it the other way around. And then lastly, you go to the mouth. I'm drawing this jaggedy kind of line. I want to make sure it's round because he's his head is a rounded form, right? But I also want to make it jaggedy, you know what I mean? Like their teeth. And I'm going to be pulling these things almost like they're stitches. Just think of them as stitches, even though they are technically just, you know, cartoon teeth. Uh, let me fill in, fill this in. Anyways, I filled that in. Uh, I could fill it in darker, but the marker is kind of dying on me right now. So what I'm going to do is going to do one last thing. I'm going to actually follow the curve of the outside and just thicken that line a little bit. I'm going to turn the paper as I do that because as you see, the natural stroke of my uh, kind of wrist and or elbow when I'm doing this is uh, in this natural form. So you don't, I don't want to have to like, you know what I mean? It's going to be a lot harder to pull strokes the other way. So what would be easier would be just turning the paper. Way easier, way, way easier. You know, don't fight it, right? Why not just go with, uh, you know, go with it. Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas was actually one of my favorite movies growing up and I still enjoy it, which is crazy. I think that's why it's really survived so long. You know, it's because so many people like it, like it just, it doesn't really get outdated too. And anyways, that is it. Thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, check out more videos on this channel. This channel is only going to be around for the month, I think. I mean, it's going to be around, but you know what I mean? I'm not going to really update it outside of the year. I might, I might update it sporadically throughout the year, but let's be honest, Halloween is Halloween. Also, be sure to share the video, guys. I'll see you guys later.